Hi, I'm Adam Mattis. I'm here with Albert from Quantum Machinery. We're actually here at West Tech 2015 at their booth showing off one of the latest things on the market. This is really exciting to see. I haven't seen too many of these, especially on the used market, there is none. So, on the new market, this is a Quantum Idera, which is a very, very well-trusted brand, been around a really long time. A BB5020, it's a 55 ton, over seven foot overall. Very nice, clean machine, quick clamps. A uh, nice color, easy access controller. We'll go ahead and show you a little bit of that, how you can do some setup and running. But the main thing on this machine is that it's an electric machine. So what that machine means is that it actually runs off of servos and a ball screw rather than a hydraulic. So what would one of the benefits be for having an electric brake over a hydraulic or a mechanical brake? The accuracy rate when you start it in the mornings is going to be the same as the afternoons when you end. So uh, your positions will always be the same on a electric press brake versus hydraulic. So on, on a hydraulic press brake, what happens basically is you have your two cylinders and you have the oil. After a while running it all day, you know, doing a lot of production, you're going to heat up that oil, you heat up those seals, you lose a little bit of tonnage, it seeps a little bit more. So this is going to give you just absolute dead on accuracy every time you start the machine up and you can go right back to exactly the day before when you were doing your work and you're going to be really, really accurate. So as I say, it's a seven axis machine. You can see the light curtains on each side or laser lights. Uh, we're going to go through a few different uh, modes here. You can take a look at this really great controller. We'll turn it over to you, Albert. All right. So here we're going to, we already have a program set up. So uh, we're going to run the program. Another great thing about this machine is it's very, very quiet. You don't have the big hum of the electric motor. It's just what you hear from the servos. And you, you only use the uh, power, of course, while it's on, so the motors are not on all the time. Which saves a little bit of electricity. Electricity, exactly. And once you're talking about some larger machines, you're going to be using a lot of electricity during the day for some major production. So this might come in really handy. You notice the back gauge is moving ever so slightly in and out as well to the different positions. take a look here on the controller you can see the actual bend angles running right through on the control you see exactly where you're at this is the different types of tools that are in the machine right now you got your four-way on the bottom you got your die on the top so you can see the tooling it's all set up it knows what's tooling in the machine already you can come back to your program put your tools back in it's going to save a lot on your production times and setups especially right here you can see you're going to have your programs you go into there you can recall different programs that you have set up Here's the different tooling that you have set up, maybe the different tools in the shop. You put all the different ones in there, and your uh, operators can go right to work. Your punches, Here's all your the dies. punches and the dies as well. Now what I want to do is go around to the back of the machine, run it a few more times, let you see how all the cylinders are working, how the, uh, the servo drive motors. Servo drive motors are working. You went through the curtain. So you'll notice also on the back side there's a set of light curtains so that'll keep anybody out of the range of the back gauge and any of the components in the rear. Obviously, safety is one of the most important things on a press brake.
So obviously this is one of the newer high-tech machinery uh, at the show. Like your short and press brakes, seven axis machines, perhaps you don't need that many, but you need single axis, two axis. Depending on the work that you're doing, we can show you how we're going to do So thank you very much for showing us the machine no as usual, no Albert. If you have any questions on this machine, give us a call at 626-444-0311. You can check out our website for a complete, a complete inventory, including great financing options, at sterlingmachinery.com. Thank you. Sterling Machinery sells all types of metalworking, fabricating, and chip making machinery such as lathes, metal shears, press brakes, punch presses, punches, grinders, milling machines, saws, plate rolls, iron workers, inspection equipment, welders, and much more. Sterling Machinery is one of the largest stocking dealers of new and used machine tools in the United States. You can view over 2,000 machine tools available for inspection on our floor or visit www.sterlingmachinery.com to view all machine specifications, photos, videos, prices, and buyer's guides for all types of equipment. If you can't find the machine you're looking for, please give us a call at 626-444-0311 and our educated staff can find the right machine for you.
you have surplus equipment for sale? From one machine to entire shops, Sterling Machinery buys all types of equipment. Please contact us today. Thank you and we hope to see you soon. To view more helpful videos along with how-to videos and machinery for sale, please visit www.machinerytube.com, the web's premier machinery video site.